Let's say the truth. Most of the modern Tantra has nothing or very little to do with uh, the original Tantra. What you find in the so-called Tantra festivals has 80-90% of uh, things that are invented in the last decades. Now we have many of these mixing like shamanic tantra or whatever they are called, you know, where things are being put together, but this has nothing to do with the traditions. So to really learn and understand what tantra is in its origin, in this classical version, you really need to go to some lineage, so some teacher that have a direct um, connection with uh, the original Tantra. So it's not easy to find uh, such teachings nowadays in the midst of this uh, Tantric mess that we have uh, around. Most of these workshops or, or gatherings they are based on promiscuity or easy and free sex, uh, but this is nothing to do with the original Tantra. Of course, the classical Tantra has a lot of teachings about uh, sexuality, but that became an obsession in the modern Tantra. So in classical Tantra, we learn the spiritual path of realizations through sexuality, through also conscious relationship. But basically, it's whatever you're doing in your life that can become Tantric. It's about putting awareness on everything you're doing. The using of a specific technology like mantras, yantras, repetitions, practices that come from Hatha Yoga, from many energetical practices are the world of Tantra. So Tantra has a very deep specific traditions that is nearly lost. And my biggest desire since I started to teach Tantra uh, was to really share in the world the origin of this tradition because that is uh, something that changed my life and I really want to see this change in the world. I really want to see the people who change their life through the tradition of Tantra. And so that is something that always moved me to share uh, this teaching in the world. And uh, um, this is still accessible, but it has to be very much from the desire of someone to go deep, to really find the spiritual path that can transform your life deeply. Okay, so that is uh, the right approach.